Hi you guys, so we're going to be doing another first impressions review video and this time we're going to be doing the Maybelline Pumped Up Colossal Mascara. You get 9.7 milliliters or 0.33 fluid ounces. I got it in the color Glam Black. It says up to 16 times volume. It has collagen in it. It pumps up lashes or up to 16 times volume. Pumped up brush delivers colossal impact. Ophthalmologist tested, contact lens safe. So it does say not to let it dry in between coats, so we're going to be doing two coats today. I paid $5.89 for this at Harman's. I did line my eyes a little bit, and I love the packaging on these. Really, really cute packaging. I love the bright colors. Cute. I like it. I will be curling my lashes, though, just, just because. So this is what it looks like. So that's like the two ridges and then a nice size fluffy brush at the end. It goes on really nicely. Definitely is more of a wet mascara. So let's take a look. This is with one coat of mascara. Let's put a second coat on my right eye before it dries. It is not irritating my eyes, which is important because I have really sensitive eyes. I don't know if you can tell, can you guys tell? Look how much more volume this eye has. Definitely opened everything up. Let's do my other eye. Since it is a bigger brush, you do have to be careful, especially with your lower lashes. It's one coat. Let's do a second. I myself do like wet mascaras. I feel like it's less work in applying. So far, this looks really good. I'm going to see how it wears throughout the day, see if there's any fallout or anything like that. 12.33 right now, and I will let you guys know. So it is now 10.40 at night. My husband and I are actually at a friend's house. Sorry that I'm doing the final update like this, but I wanted to give you guys an update. So basically, throughout the day, the mascara did not bother my eyes at all. Although it is a very wet formula, it's lightweight, which I love because my lashes still feel soft. The mascaras kind of tend to make your lashes stiff. And then I also feel like it's hard to take it off because of the stiffness, which also for me personally, I feel like there's a lot of lashes that come out when I try to take it off, and that's not good. So this one though is super lightweight, and if you can see, it's not heavy or anything like that at all. There really wasn't much fallout or anything like that. Also, another thing is, if you do have longer lashes, sometimes mascaras with more of a wet formula tend to weigh your lashes down and make them a little bit more droopy. My lashes aren't that long, so I don't have a problem. But I feel like with the lightness of this mascara, if you do have longer lashes, you don't have to worry about them kind of falling down. I do feel like it definitely added volume to my lashes. Not so much separation, but that's not really what its purpose is. So overall, my thoughts on the Maybelline Pumped Up Colossal Lashes Mascara. I'm very happy with it, so it's definitely a go in my book. Again, I do apologize that I'm doing the final update like this, but regardless, I hope that it was helpful for you guys. If it was, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Let me know if you tried this mascara and what you think of it or other mascaras that you would recommend for me to try or you want me to try before you actually go out and get it. Be sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this, and as always, be sure to stay happy, you guys.